Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I will be covering 90 Day Fiance, the season 6 tell all part 1. As you already noticed, I lost my voice all this week, so I wanted to upload a video earlier, but I had to wait until you could at least understand what I'm saying. So with that being said, let's get into it. Um, <clears throat> it was overall kind of boring. Um, there really wasn't much to it. Plus, the cult and Larissa drama is happening in the second part. So, it's kind of like pointless watching the first part if you're looking for drama. I'm just going to kind of touch um, on some points based on the tell-all. So, there was a lot of Ashley and Jay um, in this tell-all. Ashley seems like she cannot stand Jay. Um, Jay's excuses, and I do believe their excuses, were, were dumb. But it seems like they really, really don't like each other. or Not necessarily don't like each other, but they're really on the outs with each other. So that's kind of the main atmosphere with Jay and Ashley. I don't know why Ashley was getting like very aggressive, talking about something like my back hand is strong. You don't want to see the ratchet get into me, like ratchet get out of me. Like I don't know. Ashley sounded like low key a little bit like crazy, and I was just like, calm down. Like first of all, this is none of your business. So just calm down. Um, Jonathan Fernanda, there was about like talking about. Um, him building a relationship with his mom and Fernanda being lonely, but I feel like that Fernanda being lonely was <clears throat> the storyline for most of um, their most of their um, like season. It was kind of the same old same old. So you, they don't really have problems and stuff. So there really wasn't much to say with them. I feel like they lightly glided on Eric and Lita um, about the whole child support thing. That to me was a very, very big issue and why <clears throat> sorry, why I can't stand Lita or Leda at all. Um, I felt like her tears were uh, crocodile tears, so I really didn't believe her. Sorry about that, I had to change my camera battery, but um, like I was saying, Lita, to me, it seemed like she had crocodile tears. I did not believe her tears. I was just kind of like, it makes it look better if you look like you're apologetic. But I think she's still trash, and they didn't go hard enough on Eric because the way that Eric treated his children was very unacceptable and they could have took more time in basically dogging them like I do agree Colt and Larissa have a lot of drama but Eric and Lita have a lot of drama um, off camera as well so I, I didn't really appreciate that they talked about Kalani in Asuelu. Asuelu cried again. Um, his explanation for why he didn't support his child was really dumb. Um, because even if you thought that uh, Kalani was rich or America is rich, you don't want to give your child anything. There should be nothing that comes from your father. Everything should just be from your mother. So, I thought it was, like, dumb. Um, <clears throat> what else? Uh, Steven and Olga. Like, there's something wrong with Steven. Uh, Sean asked him, um, does he, I said something like, does he have anything to say to Olga, like, basically apologizing for how he's treated her. And this man stood there and was like, 
no, I don't owe her any apology or anything. And everybody was looking at him like he's crazy because they're just like, are you kidding me? You didn't treat her very good. You were very, very hard on her. You were very mean to her when she had just had your child. Um, but they still seem like they're going strong, so it is what it is with them. Um, <clears throat> so while they're doing different segments, um, you don't see Colt and Larissa. Well, Colt and Larissa, um, I don't know, something happened with their flight where they got delayed and when they finally reached New York, they found out that the airport lost Larissa's luggage, which will throw basically Larissa's whole plan, um, I don't know, down the drain because the big, I guess the big issue with them is that there's some things that happen on social media. I don't like to talk about it because I'm here to recap the show, not really what happens after the show, but there was something that happened to Larissa and Colt, um, and Colt devolving, sorry, devolving, evolving, the, involving the police and uh, people on Instagram and just getting people in their business and Larissa was arrested for domestic battery. She's been arrested a couple times now in the States. I don't know why she hasn't been deported yet. Um, <clears throat> and Fernanda had commented on what uh, Larissa was saying. Larissa, in Larissa's eyes, she was trying to make light of a situation because it there was a lot of like negativity towards it. And Fernanda thought that like, you don't joke with, you, you don't joke or you try to, or don't try to play around play around with when it comes to these type of situations because people seriously think you're in danger when you're when you're basically calling out for 911 and all this stuff people are gonna believe you so like what do you expect people to do um they had a spot and they were back and forth and that's why they don't like each other so aside from Fernanda and Jonathan, there's other couples that cannot stand them. I think it more has to do with the relationship on social media versus what's been happening in the season. Because even though they have drama, it hasn't been like, it's been entertaining, but it hasn't been like crazy, like serious. By the way, I'm just eating a cough drop. So, um, I don't remember what I was saying or what I was going to say. But there's like a hostility towards Larissa and Colt and the whole cast. And they finally make it there. And because Larissa's suitcase is lost, she doesn't have her makeup and all the dresses that she wanted to, to bring. And she wasn't going to go out there in just plain Jane outfit. And like, I do kind of agree with Larissa on the part of. If I'm going to be seeing my enemies or if I'm going to see someone that I'm not fond of, like, I want them to see me at my best type of thing. I want to see, I want them to see me glowed up type of thing. But she was being very, she was being very diva about it. She was very, um, she was dictating the certain style she likes, the certain makeup she likes, which she obviously has a right to do it, but these are also professionals too it's kind of a two-way street let them do stuff but you can also voice your opinion she talked about her hair the producers went out to go and get her um, <clears throat> dresses and she was very frustrated because she was finding dresses that weren't her style and she didn't like and Colt kept telling her to like, this looks good, let's find something, why can't we do this, type of thing. And, <clears throat> this is the only time, really, that I see that they're united on the same front. Like, they look like they were actually a couple. That they were going to be there for each other, they're going to hold each other down. 
because they know it was them and everybody else. Um, so every time Sean is talking, she'd be like, oh, Colt and Larissa are here, but, you know, still waiting for me to come. And everyone's just kind of like, like, we don't care. Finally, Larissa gets her outfit ready and she's just like, yes, this is, I like this, this is, this is good. And and she's like, I'm going to go out there, I'm going to show Fernanda what it is and stuff. I know I'm better than her, she's whack, whatever. And they get out and there's like straight arguments. Straight arguments and uh, Sean <laughs> starts it up and he goes like, okay, we know there's a problem, let's start talking about them. And so what's your problem with... Larissa or which from Fernanda they start talking but it obviously goes into argument people are talking over each other other couples are just kind of giving like ooh like weird looks and stuff and <laughs> I'm sorry to laugh at this but like Oswald all of a sudden started like slapping his face because he cannot hear every he cannot hear both arguments at the same time like people need to talk First, and one person needs to be quiet. His face starts turning red and everything. And he's just like, like, he, he kind of scared me. I was just like, what's he trying to do? And he was, I don't know, he was so upset. And I don't know, he gave like this look. He doesn't look like this. And I was like, that's Lu. Like, you're supposed to be the sweet guy and stuff. Like, you're coming off a little scary. But, um, I guess he calmed down. And then Larissa started going, um, at Fernanda and her look. Like, I look prettier than you. I dress better than you. Look at your teeny body. Blah, 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 blah. Throwing in insults. And that's so funny because, like, the way that Colt argues, it's just like, what do you have against us anyways? Like, it's so, like, his voice is so calm. And, like, you expect people to kind of get loud and rowdy, but he's just, his voice always comes off so calm. Um, I don't know, it just makes me laugh. It doesn't, like, I don't know, like, I don't know if that's, like, him angry, but it's just, like, I couldn't take him seriously. If he was angry and he was talking to me and it was like, calm and collective voice but um that's kind of all for this episode so like I said it was boring um it was still kind of long for my liking you can see in part two they're going to continue the the fight and the drama they're also going to bring on Tasha which I was hoping they would do but I guess they're going to do it for the next episode and talk about the relationship and stuff because I really think Eric and Lita did not get shit on enough for the shit that they were doing throughout the season but yeah I think that's it um, for those who watched the video thank you for enduring the sound of my voice because um, I wanted to get this video up this week um, even though my voice is not 100% yet. Um, with that being said, thank you for watching my recap of 9 Day Fiance Season 6, The Tell All Part 1. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Just a dumb cunt, fucking sick and tired of it Maybe I could front love, maybe I could buy a zip Maybe I get fucked up, next time I could save some Why it's gotta be like this, why it's gotta be that way Put it inside, feel so rise up Banging on that loud